and welcome back to the first ever episode of Catches Win Matches. I'm your host, Fabian Fine Leg, and I'm going to take you through uh, today's play. It's uh, down at Deakin, and the boys have uh, have got a, an interesting concept. They've got the stumps and a little table as a ramp. They're going to be pinging a ball into a tennis racket and trying to take these catches. Now, the people playing today, Jordan the Sticky Mitts Parker there on the far left. Uh, just behind Caden's right shoulder is... Jake, the weapon Wastel, uh, just uh, to the to the left of Caden, over his right shoulder. Uh, in the middle is uh, Caden Wombat Gully Plant Farm McDonald. Uh, yes, he's just a hairy little wombat looking man, and uh, he, he's not the greatest of catches, but we'll see how he goes today. Behind him is Liam, the lengthy legged tall guy Van Gamst, who's six eight, and uh, if you didn't know it, he'll tell you about it. And then to the far right is a fan favourite Mitchell Bowl of Chips YouTube channel has really got much of a run uh, bowl is to the far right so uh, we're just about to get into proceedings uh, let's see how it all pans out the boys look all rested and ready now in the slips court and here we go the ball is going to get absolutely pounded into the table by Van Gemst a Leighton Hewitt type serve and here we go the first hit of the day oh there's a genuine chance there's a chance McDonald McDonald he's gone hard to his right and he's taken an absolute blinder look at this in slow motion the the wombat looking man was not quick with the footwork early but has, has lent hard with the right hand and taken a genuine snapper. There's another chance now. Bowl taps up. Wastel! Wastel's taken it to McDonald's delight. He's taken an absolute screamer. Bowl did the work. Palm down to uh, the old wicker keeper hands Wastel and he's taken a genuine screamer. Another chance now, McDonald! He couldn't quite grasp that one, that's gone for overthrows. Look at the little hairy man get off the ground, it's impeccable to see him 30 centimetres off the ground, it's quite outstanding, but he couldn't quite clunk it. Another chance now, off the bat, oh, well, still he's gone hard, he's gone hard for that one, you can't fold his effort, He's uh, he hasn't quite grasped it, but uh, in this first session of play, the boys have gone hard and heavy early, and it's, it's been quite remarkable. All right, the boys are getting ready for a little bit of single file work now. You know, some of the catches we saw earlier were quite impeccable. Let's see how well the fellas, let's see how they all go. So here we go, Bowl's got to go. He's got to make up some ground. Oh, he's gone with the one hand. Mitchell, bowl of chips, bowl. Well, he's taken a genuine clunk there. That's impeccable. McDonald getting ready. Off the bat, there's another chance! He's taking it one-handed! And, oh, he's given the guy with the rake a bit of a shush. He's given the guy with the rake a bit of a shush, I believe. Let's have a look at this. Oh, look at the legs go. The little hairy man sticks out the right mick, clunks it. And am I correct? Yes, goes to the guy with the rake and says, Be quiet. Put the rake down and be quiet. Parker's got to go. Parker does go. He does go. You bet your bottom dollar he does. And he absolutely slides in just as smooth as McDonald used to slide into a uh, girl's Facebook Messenger apps uh, back in the day in high school. Just uh, really smooth and uh, with, with great success. Bowl's got to go. He's got to go. He can't quite take it. Then Gibbs has backed him up there. Bowl. Jeez. He's a hopper. He's an absolute Jacob Hopper, this bloke, and he's nearly taken one of the Mark McGugans of the year, but hasn't quite, hasn't quite brought it down, the young bowman. Another chance off the racket. Now Van Gems, he's been consistent all day, hasn't dropped one. <laughs> That's in the bread basket. <laughs> he's 6'8", if you didn't know, and he's just all business. Great clunk. McDonald again. He's got to go. He's, oh, he's dropped it. Ah, oh, he's dropped it. That's disappointing. Reminds me of under-13s when everyone that he used to play with in the Premiership side said... Ken McDonald's catching academy. He was uh, the laughing stock in the field and continues to be so, which is disappointing. Oh, Mr. Consistently, Van Gemps, he's, uh, he's just, oh, he's taking it again, hasn't he? And that's the thing we like about him. He's just down the line, all business, that bloke. Now, there was a bit of an incident, ladies and gentlemen, down at Deakin University football ground, and um, it was nearly a sour note on an otherwise successful day at the office. But uh, Liam Van Gemst had the tennis racket and had a, a hardened rubber ball. Not, not, not quite cricket ball hard, but it was certainly packing a punch, this little pill. And he smacked it at the boys, hoping the boys to mark it, hoping the boys can catch it. Put a little bit too much height on it, and I'll let you watch. This lady walking behind nearly lost her life. So the boy's getting ready. It's not hitting the table, this one. This is getting smacked straight at them. Over their head. Oh, heads up! 
Heads up, darling! Oh, the boy's reaction. They thought she was gone. They thought she was a plain and simple goner. Liam Van Gems has nearly murdered someone. The boys, they're in disbelief. They don't know how to react. The lady didn't flinch. Look at that. Oh, it's a whisker. Another coat of paint and her head would have been absolutely obliterated. That is too close for comfort. Comfort. Look at Mitchell Bowl. He turns around and he can't even watch. He can't even watch. He's in disbelief. That was nearly a real talking point from the Catches Win Matches afternoon at Deakin. Uh, to wrap up this day of filming on Catches Win Matches, the first and probably only episode, the boys just started doing some contested slip work, which you don't see often at the cricket field. You don't see often uh, the, the, the keeper and, and the first and second and third and fourth slip uh, trying to take absolute Jeremy Howes at each other, but that's what happened. And let's see how some of the contests uh, ended up. So the boys are deep in the 50 here. Look at this. The slips very close together. Unorthodox slip cordon. And they go up and they can't quite take the clunk. They can't quite take the clunk. And here we go for the second attempt. The boys, McDonald's coming deep. Bowl for the side. And no one can quite hold that one. Uh, Jordy Parker with the only disposal for the day, I would have thought. And this one goes up. Here we go. The boys ready to launch. They're ready to launch. Wastel from deep. Can't quite park it. But uh, you know they need a little bit, a little bit more talk in the in the field here. Wastel from eight deep takes an absolute contested grab. Jake Wastel, that was impeccable. And here we go again, ball up. Wastel again. Wastel has gone into a little bit of beast mode, and it goes deep on the fence. Wastel, what an absolute clunk this guy is, David Neitz, if I've ever seen it. Ball goes long on the fence. McDonald! Will he ever come down? Look at this. He just got up there. He said, I'm Jeremy Howe and you're Tom McDonald fence. And takes uh, an absolute classic catch.